Okay, this uh, firearm is pointed in a safe direction. No magazine. And uh, chamber's empty. Uh, so this is a classic little Ruger 1022. Everybody knows what this is. Uh, it was a gift from a good friend. When I got it, it was in this wooden stock. And uh, although it's a nice piece of wood, um, you know, I, I really was kind of having a hard time with it. And um, it wasn't very accurate. Um, I didn't think it was my shooting. This is pretty slippery, and I couldn't get good purchase on the stock up here or down here at the grip. So I ended up getting this Hogue rubber stock. Um, it uh, feels much better. I really like it. Uh, and it's basically just uh, one screw that you take out. And then I took a little, uh, when I was disassembling it, I took a little band off the top here. But I like this stock a lot more. And then my, uh, my, my dad recommended that I get what's called a BX trigger. And this is a BX trigger. He really recommended that. So I went ahead and got that too. Um, and, uh, and installed that and I mean let me say wow it is out of this world um, my dad was really adamant that I get the trigger and, and he was right uh, I guess they come with a, a red trigger I'm sure maybe they make some of a different color but it's called a Ruger BX trigger um, I got this one for like $63 on eBay which is a uh, pretty good, pretty good price. Looks like the going rate of them is maybe uh, uh, you know eighty or ninety dollars, uh, maybe ninety-seven in some places. Uh, but eBay had one for sixty-three. The uh, Bud's Gun Shop website had them for sixty-three too. Um, but I think maybe the eBay had free shipping, so I believe that's why I went with it. But don't quote me on that. Um, you know, obviously read the directions and all those things. Here's the old trigger. It's a pretty simple installation. There's a couple pins you had to take out. The new trigger came with this piece on it. And, um, I think that like held the hammer back or something. Um, again, not going to get into like the details on the installation. It, you know, you guys can kind of read the directions and figure that out. But, uh really recommend it it's very 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 nice um and the hoax stock comes with uh the mounting points for a sling at the front of the stock in the in the rear up here so i'll put a little butler sling on it the old wooden stock didn't have those i could have drilled them in but um but yeah this thing's this thing's a lot of fun i'm probably going to upgrade the scope on it um and uh maybe i'll make a video when i do that if you can hit uh, like and subscribe, it really helps me out. Uh, just trying to make some kind of practical videos uh, that are really straightforward uh, about things that I had questions about. Thank you.